Oh, yeah. Oh, fire. Fire. How about yellow fire? Get up. I hope it looks good in there. Oh! <laughs> Cranky! <laughs> oh, I'll need that later. Oh, that too. Man, this thing's got it. <laughs> I need that too. Take that home with me. You guys can weld that back up. I think we should be able to make something with yeah. it. Oh, there's another rod over here. Yeah, it looks like it take out the two of them. Man. Okay. You, did, you did good. Well, if you're going to send it, send it. Alright, so it's Friday. We are headed to uh, Garrett's shop, Cletus' shop. We're meeting James. We needed something more to work on before drag week, so uh, Andy, Brian, and I, and Chad, behind the camera, flew in, <coughs> and we're going to go ahead and uh, figure out a motor to put in the bald reel, because tomorrow is a pay-per-view, so um, kind of down to the wire, but really a pretty easy car to work on so I don't foresee anything too crazy going on but we do need to get a motor in it and uh, Project Prime swung by late, late last night and uh, put some new livery on the bald regal so I'm pretty excited to see that because I think it's going to be very uh, patriotic and uh, I think you guys are going to like it. Hey James. Here to fix some stuff? I think, hopefully. You got all parts now, so. Should be in good shape. Yeah. I How brought was the up? guns. Yeah, see you brought backup too. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it's uh, all your parts are over there. All right. Dude, that's so cool. <laughs> Did you see the, the rap on this ball reel? Oh shit, when did he do that? Last night he said he came. Dude, that is awesome. <laughs> <laughs> he must have done it after I left. That yeah. was good about him setting the ball play. Yeah, he said he came like 10 or 11 last night. Hey, it's not a rap. Pretty good. Like the ball yeah. the thunder wheel. Dude, that's amazing. Dude, that's awesome. That really brings it all together. Yeah. Oh, I forgot how Dude, that was. thing is sweet. Headliner's <laughs> sagging some more in this humid environment. Well, what you need to get is a pack of thumbtacks and yeah. you just thumbtack it up. Every, <laughs> you, got, you got a stapler? <laughs> every six inches, you just put another one. But we but. got the fix right over there. Thank you all, man. Uh, that is. The old motor out of Ruby. So that is the Rod Piston 5.3 that we just had freshened up for a backup motor for Ruby. And um, we're like, hey, you blew your motor up. This motor's done in the machine shop. Let's uh, put it in the car. Perfect timing. Yeah. I mean, it's like almost like it was meant to be. It was hard to put another 600,000 mile motor in. So hopefully we can just get some a lot of rips out of that. Yeah. Second. Well, the other thing too, being Rod Piston, it's clearance and all stuff for boost. So yeah. it should be uh, a little safer. Yeah. Should be good to go. So it's getting a little Ruby's old heart in it. Rocking so. the new shirt, I see. Yeah, that shirt is sick. <laughs> but uh, it's gonna be a long day. It is gonna be a long day. But by the end of the day, it'll be running. We'll be ripping. Do a test burnout in the parking lot. I think that's only fair. A.M. We'll see what time we fire it at. What time do you think, Chad? Oh God. Noon. 
<laughs> I'm gonna say 2 p.m. 3? 2 p.m. You guys are pros, you can do it. By we time. got a lot of work ahead of us. <laughs> How's it look? Well, we gotta check the spark plugs to see if we can reuse them, but other than that. <laughs> what is, oh, there's the freedom hole. <laughs> you excited? I mean, that's, oh, like, so fun. that's like 200 horsepower right there. For sure. We don't need the horsepower. We don't need any more horsepower. Just bearings. No, 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 no. Yes, you do. I'd throw a swap. Give me a 13. Bro. I'm going to rip these from Using from the old motor. Definitely not the oil pan. So we got a new oil pan putting together. Uh, probably the headers, the accessories, maybe a cylinder head. And uh, couple bolts. That's about it. Everything else is gone. It's a trash pile. This is so nice for the Baldur Eagle. I'm so happy for it. You have a new heart. So when I, <laughs> when I got the rings in we were waiting for and I dropped them off, he goes, all right, it'll be done later today or tomorrow. Later that day he calls me. He goes, hey, is this thing going to be on video or anything? I was like, yeah. He goes, I'm going to throw a fresh can of black paint on it. <laughs> So it's like all painted up and everything ready to go. Well, she earned her stripes, you know, after that first rip. Yeah. Uh, does it have like a fillet barbell in the back instead of like a plastic? Yes. Oh, okay. So at uh, Sac City's Court, they like sell a bunch of uh, fillet, like front cover, rear cover alignment tools and all the billet oil galley stuff. Yep. They sell them, like the front plugs billet. I, I just so, saw those for the first time the other day. So yeah, I was he at gave them, like, them to me like a couple years ago in uh, I think last year, beginning of last year in Houston. He's like, hey, my dad owns this company. Try these out. And he sent them and dude, I, they're awesome. I've bought, yeah, bought two oh, sets. Yeah, I've bought two sets since then. That's legit. Yeah, because I mean it replaces this. These, uh, I've seen these blow out before. Yep. And then the, Plastic Every time I put a motor in, I always check for that because I've done it. I yeah. put them in before and forgot them. Yeah, so I mean, they, they're awesome. Perfect. Hell yeah. What? She's good. Gold. Gold. Didn't even hurt the top side of the piston. Not on this side, at least. That's where the hole goes. Heads are good. Perfect. Can I read the heads? I think so. Nice. Crank these around. Oh, I'm going to shoot for the coolant. Balance the covers, our water pump. What's up? How's it going? Damn, so he blows it up and he brings you in too. Yeah. Unreal. <laughs> I'm not doing this by myself. Damn. <laughs> it's a team effort. I need a brother like that. This guy's perks. Sometimes. That's a real rowdy camshaft. Thank you to Texas Speed for getting us a replacement bump stick out quick. Jason, Trevor, and the guys, you guys rock. Check it out. You know, oiler up. Oil her up. Finesse. 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 Slide right in. Yeah, I mean, this motor's got a bunch of good parts in it. Should no. have, uh, Johnson lifters, that Mellon's oh, oil pump. Yeah, I need to get a list so I can get you this thing replaced. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's good. I mean, it really, I mean, it's a decent motor. Yeah, it looks like it's got all good stuff in it. Is it pretty fresh? It doesn't look like it's got... It was just freshened up. Oh, it was? Yeah, that's oh, what he nice. was doing. We took it out of the car. No, I meant before this, though. Oh, no, I mean, it was in Ruby for... Oh, wow. 
Yeah, it was in there for race week. We put it in right before race week. It was in there for race week last year. Oh, okay. And all year, did a couple head gaskets throughout the course of the year. And then when we decided to put the 427 in Ruby, we're like, well, this was such a good motor. I mean, we went 830s with this motor. So yeah, we're like, yeah. we'll just get it freshened up, make it new again, and just shelf it. Yep. And then the Motion Boys came into town and said, hey, watch this. <laughs> How the head flip? They do good. You guys got a crank bolt up there you can get me? A crank bolt? Yeah. The ARP one out of that one? What? I don't have it off yet, no. Probably need it here shortly. Just want to verify this. Turn it over one. Feel like pointing out the trailer, pull back up, put the way up, and then start straight up the trailer. Clear this mode. Here, just drag that motor over in. Path of least resistance. So how do you think we're doing, Doug? We're getting there. That's no uh, big craziness yet. Uh, we're going to put the stock heads back on it, so it's only going to be like three-quarters ruby motor, but I don't think it really needs a big aftermarket set of heads for the burnout competition just yet. Maybe later on. Well, at least all the pistons are in the hole. Actually, don't even look at that. Okay. Uh, we definitely kissed a valve right there. What? We definitely kissed a valve. We might want to check that valve out. <laughs> oh no! Oh, you made it. Oh, he's getting pinched. Get him, get him in the box. That's what, what I was trying to do. Hell, he he drank some huge. more. He drank some more. Put him in the box and then go give the box to George. Say, Yo, look what I got you for race week. <laughs> So you guys are going to reuse your heads or are you going to put uh, No, because the one hit the piston pretty hard. I mean, honestly, I'm glad you just put the nice heads on. <laughs> What's that? I think it needs a good head. You're going to sing it up in the RPM. I mean, did you guys have valve springs on the other yeah, one? Yeah. Oh, well, he's getting good. Why don't we just put the good heads on it, Brian? So what's wrong with the old ones? Um, the old heads? Well, come over here. I'll show you. Yeah. When this piston divorced from the rod that it was attached to, it kissed the, I would say more kissed, it punched that valve, and then if you look over here, the valve's uh, crooked in here, so we're not going to be able to reuse those heads. Oh yeah. It's supposed to seal up a little better than that. George wasn't scared. Bummer. <laughs> nuts and bolts. All right. Hey, if you need anything, man, I'm trying to be kind of like all around all day. So. All right. Appreciate it. Oh, okay. Cool. Thank you. Oh, so Y'all got to back up. Like, Is this what Doug right helped put together well, before? Yeah. Y'all have people it's to back down. up. I'm like, back up. Cable drive fuel pump. Yeah, then I hear well, This thing goes right on these tabs in the back there. You see that? I only one up front. Yeah, that's I'll guide her in. I'll guide her home. Motion race works. Fuel pump drive there. I don't know if you saw that. You know where to go. Nick Shaft from City. Oh, she's holding up nicely. Another fuel pump. She had a rough week last year. Pulling out of the trailer to start race week. Yeah. We crunched it. Remember I was calling you? Oh, yeah. Big bro. <laughs> SOS. I need something. Now I'm going to have you right there this year. 
I won't have parts, but I'll be right there. <laughs> Done. We got to make some calls. I'll do it. We're trying to remove the, uh, the balancer right now. After that, this motor will be completely undone. <laughs> it will go on to that junkyard in the sky. Sad. Wah, wah, wah. Dude, oh, we got another radio for you guys. Oh, sweet. They're so sick. These, so these play music on your phone, off your phone, and take calls. And I swear you can hear, like, you can whisper and they can hear you. Really? And then, like, when someone calls you, like, the music automatically dims, or, like, say James just talking to me, like, automatically goes down, and you can hear him do this. They're, like, That's legit. Helicopter headsets are so badass. Mm -hmm. so really These cool. rugged radios. Last year we screamed oh. at each other the whole year, the whole weekend, and everything we screamed was on her. <laughs> You'd say something to your passenger and just no response. Be like, all right. <laughs> <laughs> Look at the crust. It's got to go back in it. That's the heart and soul of the oh, project. Can't church it up too much. It won't be happy. What would it do with all that? Chad, what would it do with all that fancy mess? It just probably wouldn't run. Use this dial pin crank pinning deal before. There's time for everything. Well, that ain't gonna work. What? To pin the crank like that. They have like a different style deal. That must be for like a different style balancer, huh? I've yeah, do it with the balancer on. I've always pinned them with it on. Yeah, I guess we could just drill without a fixture. You think, huh? George has one. Well, this is this is a fixture he gave me, but it's like oh, drilled. That, that's a front style oh. pin. Yeah, I wonder versus if we have the ATI, like you drill through it and put a pin through. Oh. The snout. I've seen that style before. I've never. I think that's a lot of people like, use like stock bouncers with that. Oh, like. I would just take cut off this. You know, <laughs> just stick a key in there. That's, the same as what you got. that's more what we need. So, because Ruby's old motor had uh, just a stock crank and it doesn't have a uh, pin or a uh, keyway for the balancer. So, if you watched our first videos um, on a blower setup, you don't want the, you know, if you don't have a pin or a keyway, the balancer actually spin on the crank, which will A, mess up the crank. All week, I love it. Welcome to Florida, pal. <laughs> that went so well. Listen, I was terrified. <laughs> so, so I was saying before Libra I started up is if you don't have a keyway or a pin in the crank, um, the balance will actually slip on the crank, which will a damage the crank and b uh, you'll lose boost because you aren't spinning the blower like you should. So. We definitely want to pin the crank so we can go full send and burn out path. Some new gaskets? Yep, only the best. Dude, the bald regal is getting some fanciness. Look at these. Cletus Edition Johnson lifters. Ooh, hot damn. Yeah, those are keepers. But those should live pretty well up in RPMs, hopefully.
just that easy. Yeah, when you tend to go through motors like underwear, you end up with a <laughs> bunch of spare parts. You tend your underwear that often? Yeah. You do? Unfortunately. <laughs> it's hot down here. It's yeah, Florida I was say, it's Florida. Yeah, there's, if you don't want to use it in your head bowls, we got head studs. Uh, yeah, I don't care one way or another. Yeah, yeah. this motor had studs in it. Sets oh, right. yeah. He probably didn't know that when he brought those out. So. Not far away from making noise now. Damn near ready to fire. It's no longer. Are you having fun? Yeah. Okay, good. It's a little hot though. I'm not used to this heat. Well, we can close the doors now. And no, you're fine. Well, we got AC. Oh, you do? Yeah. We'll wait till they're done that way. Okay. That way. I'll make sure they're on and then you guys are ready to shut the door and we'll cool down. Sweet. Thank you. And I'll free up my account. What's the time table look like tomorrow? Drive means at three. Three? Okay. Yeah. Perfect. Hey, by the way. Are you guys gonna finish out your hands today or what? Yeah. Okay, yeah, because um, if you guys want to come, I'm having like dinner at my house at eight. Okay. And basically, everyone's invited. Just okay. I figured if we all try to go to the restaurant, it wasn't worked out. So sure. We're just cooking out at my house. Okay. Figured we'll have it done by then. Eight p.m. Yeah, yeah. Just shoot down there. Cool, man. Appreciate right, it. Yep. Coop, did you hear that? Uh, eight p.m. in your place. Yeah. Bring as many white claws as I plan to drink. Bring as many. Bring a bunch of white claws to the. <laughs> thanks dude yeah thank you guys for showing up so Doug where we're at what do you think about our timeline oh no big deal should have the heads on here in like probably an hour or less both the accessories on right in there be doing burnout before dinner I just want to get like an air launcher off the Lunch time! Oh, so deserved. I kind of wanted to honk at him, but scared the shit out of him. I'd see Cooper fall off. are way too nice for it tomorrow. So I'm, <laughs> no, we'll, we'll use them on something else later. Or just never. Let's say if it stays together. All right, need some bolts, boys. I got these for you, pal. Thank you. Very nice of you. How much are they? What there are you they? go. What are they? I don't know. I just bought them. Said I ain't looking them. for handouts, man. Spark plugs on there, like a dollar eighty a piece or something. Somebody order some. Sure did. Yeah. Forget it, the car runs. It took my helmet out. Need some for a helmet. Rip this thing out. It does look little. Are you sure these aren't kids? That's a kid's helmet. That's way too little. It's an XL. There's no shot. It's an XL. Dude. <laughs> 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 You got it. Crank is pinned. Whew. Ready for all the boosties. Need about 11 Ugga Duggas on this bolt here. You know what an Ugga Dugga is too? No, I've never heard of that term when, before. Uh, when an uh, impact goes Ugga Dugga Dugga Dugga. Oh yeah. yeah. Count 11 of them and that's when it's tight. <laughs> right, Brian? Okay, maybe seven. Depends how charged up the battery is, you know. <laughs> if it was air powered, it wouldn't be a big. Need to be eleven.
They put bolts in the, the steel them out of ours. The front cover. I remember the last time I put all my gas to fight that in the water. Yeah, that gets pulling. Doesn't make any sense. So are you going to be riding when the, you do the burnouts? Yeah, I think I'm going to ride along. Take some cool footage. Nice. And uh, because of that, I decided it might be a good idea to put a second set of bolts in here. Or <laughs> I did, anyways. I value my life a little bit. So. <laughs> Just a tad. I had some old belts laying around that I could throw in here and, and make work. Uh, go forward, actually. There you go. Go forward. I remember the water pump's tight on it. So it's only sitting on the jack, so. The car's not sitting on anything. Need to go down just I think it comes down. Yeah, come down. Just a bit. Come down? Yep. Are you sitting on the power steering up here? Yeah, it's good. What? You're rocking the boat. <laughs> I can see that. Uh, a little bit more. Oh, too far. It goes down through with this. Wait. What a chance to have an ICT belt. That belt's like tight on there now. Yeah. Ain't got yeah. Much. She, she ain't going nowhere. She ain't going nowhere. It does. It's coming off like a rubber band. <laughs> yeah. It was a real ripper. Best belt we had. Only one we had. <laughs> nope. Bring back the fun feet. Oh man, I wish that camera wasn't on. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go in. Got in. him. <laughs> Thought it was. Never be too safe, Chad. <laughs> <laughs>